saying they get an excuse to get off. Mm -hmm. Right? You have an excuse to get off? If, if you was working, you were working mm -hmm. in the trash department, yep. and you had a couple of days off, and you could get paid for it, what would you do? Go to work? Busy. Are you mad People or call not? about potholes, Are you graffiti, mad abandoned vehicles, not? and drainage Big problems, mad, little sidewalk mad. and curb repairs, no, but really, tree what trimming, are you mad and at? garbage collection. Yep, yep, to the yep, yep. You already know what time it is. It's your girl, Tamara Russell, also known as POC, host the Revive Radio, reporting live on behalf of WHYY. We're live right now with a Philadelphia resident, and I got to ask you a question. You know, with everything going on in the city of Philadelphia, especially during this quarantine season, one thing that stood out the most to our residents was the trash. You know what I mean? The trash really went up in the city. And I want to know, you know, when it comes down to the trash pickup around the city, does that make you mad or not? Absolutely. And I understand there's a lot going on right now, but we've done, we've been doing these cleanups for the past couple of weeks. And um, a couple of the spots we previously cleaned up. There's been garbage there for two or three weeks and it hasn't gotten picked up. What do you think that the city can do? Um, a number of things. First off, just get people involved in the community and get them out and doing cleanups and start organizing in the local community and on a local level and get people to care more. Um, nothing's going to change unless you teach people the right way to do things and you are acting on your own free will and, and showing other people that you care for. My name is Jared Hudak, um, and I teach at Gompers in West Philly. Are you mad or oh, I'm not? very mad. Um, my name is Shams uh, Lincoln, and uh, I own a fatty fabric store on 52nd Street. When I was dealing with the, the paperwork, everything, I didn't know that it's so, like, that much dirty. Mm -hmm. So the store is already here, and we're doing good. So, okay, but when I walk around... Uh, I'm, I'm not happy about my neighborhood. What can we put in place? A park named after a person like Malcolm X. Mm -hmm. And you have Muhammad Ali Way in the same place. And we litter like we don't care. We don't need to have money to just have a clean neighborhood. I see you with your lovely skates on. Now, one of the main concerns here in the city is the trash, you know, pile up. And I got to ask you, does it ever uh, affect you when you're riding your skates? And does that make you mad or not? Um, hi, I'm Dayan, representing West Philly. And the trash definitely gets in the way. Um, I mean, I'm pretty new to skating, so I kind of need a flat surface. And when I have to, like, step over, like, cans or, like, bags of stuff, it makes it harder to learn how to skate so um well my name is vic i live in west philadelphia um i the trash pile up is it's not ideal like it's you know it's unsightly it smells bad but the thing is is the trash collectors are getting such a hard time from the city right now a lot of them are getting COVID. a lot of them don't have ppe um they're not getting hazard pay and i think it's more important to be in solidarity with the sanitation workers than it is to really worry about the trash pileup at the well, moment yes it does i'm from 50th and pine and i come to malcolm x park every day and the trash has been building up since COVID 19 and it's just out of whack now. Even 52nd and Market Streets are, you are dirty. Mad or not? Oh, young chef and the pit bull puppies to snatch the bag out of there and have empty diapers and cigarette wrappers and snicker packages and, and ten. What part of the city are you representing? West Philly. People can just like throw their stuff in the trash instead of being lazy and just throwing it on the street or whatever. Cause like birds can actually suffocate on like the soda can things that come in. And like I don't want to like hurt the environment makes me real man so actually my name is sadie foster i teach at gompers middle school elementary i teach seventh and eighth grade social studies and just seeing a pile up of trash is ridiculous they're more than one or two days behind they're actually i live in west philly my trash day is wednesday our trash got picked up on saturday Didn't I tell you to take out the turn your radios up switch your dials over your girl poc reporting live for whyy I'm keep your radios no. locked i'm not mad are you me. mad i'll pick up or trash no. my damn self what would you do? Bodies would be better if it was trash all around you. When you get this garbage truck on out of here, why? 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 I'd be glad to do that then.